Hello, I'm Wayne with ModularHydro.com. We're going to talk about our line of air injection technology for hydroponics, for aquariums, and for growing in soil. Air injection technology versus using an air stone allowed us to win the High Times Annual 2012 Stash Awards. So let's go ahead and we're going to talk about each one of these different applications. Our more popular sizes. Now they come in many different sizes on the website, but we're going to talk about some of our basic sizes. Here we go. Now we're going to show you three different examples. This would be growing hydroponically. And look at the air bubbles bubbling up. Just absolutely gorgeous. Let's look at our AIT for aquariums. You can see the even air distribution, absolutely gorgeous. Now let's look at our air injection technology for soil. You can see the water bubbling up and we have beautiful parsley growing here. So these are three different applications. You've got air injection technology for soil, air injection technology for aquariums or aquatic use, and air injection technology for hydroponics. Now we'll talk about some of the different sizes, some of the different basic sizes. Now let me show you some of, some of our more popular sizes of air injection technology for hydroponics, aquariums, and for growing in soil. And let's, let's start off with our uh, aquarium. This is an aquarium grid for a 5 to 10 gallon tank, which you can see over here bubbling. You can see it's doing quite beautifully. And then we're going to go off to our uh, three and a half inch air injection technology. Now this is for soil or hydroponics. Our five inch for hydroponics and soil. Our six inch for hydroponics and soil. And let's take a look at our six inch growing in our hydroponics. You can see these beautiful air bubbles bubbling up. And the key to this technology is even air delivery. It's not, it's not maximum air. It's the even amount of air. The roots don't have anywhere to hide. Now our hydro soil system on the end over there, that's a five inch hydro soil in the bottom. And you can see the air bubbles if you look real close growing up. So I guess the point I'm trying to get across is we have many different air injection technology, whether it's in grid, growing in a pot, growing in a, uh, a reservoir, or a large tank where you want to supply air. And let's talk about our world famous air injection technology spider. It's, it measures nine and a half inches across with the weights for hydroponics. For soil, nine inches. Now if you were to duplicate this, and this weighs right around three ounces, if you were to duplicate this, you would have to purchase an eight inch air disc or an air stone. And this thing weighs 2.75 pounds. It totally is very heavy. And let's go ahead and look at the bottom. It's plastic and the top is the part air stone where the air comes out. Now what's unique about the spider is it emits the air 360 degrees around all of it, all, all the air lines, all the way around. So you've got total air coverage. If you look at this, how it's emitting air all around, that's how we can supply just as much air for less than half the cost of this 2.75 pound air stone. Let's do a quick recap. Our air injection technology comes in so many different sizes. We couldn't cover them all today, but they're available for aquarium, they're available for hydroponics, and for growing in soil. You want to go to shop.modularhydro.com and then go to air injection technology. Again, I'm Wayne with modularhydro.com.